Red Wagon Farms and today we are harvesting corn. Late harvest this year. Uh, Mid-December, but believe it or not, there, it is pretty nice weather for that time of year. And the corn is pretty dry. Typically, you like your corn at below 15.5% in an ideal world. Although there is some problems when you harvest your corn at that. 15.5% means it's not going to rot. Uh, when you put it in the bin, at least for six months to a year. But uh, the problem with 15.5 is sometimes when you harvest it, it will shatter a little bit and you'll lose a little bit of yield. Uh, and when it's a little bit wetter, it doesn't do that. But you're ultimately, you're shooting for the least amount of money you have to spend drying. So this was a really, we thought this cornfield was going to be phenomenal. And we had two weeks of no rain in August, and the soil out here is extremely dry, or extremely light, so it got extremely dry. And then the consequences are that is we have low, low, uh, low ear size. So I think this will do about a hundred bushel an acre. This particular combine's just under 200 horsepower, I believe, and it has a holding capacity of about 200 bushel in it. So it's a mid, mid-range, mid-size combine. And he goes around the field one time and then we got to empty it, so. There's quite a few trucks that need to keep coming to keep him running. We are running, this green truck is five, five high, five low. So um, this button will put you in the next, uh, when it's up, it is in high, when it's down, it's low. I'll probably run, I think I'll run low here. We'll see how much weight we have on this thing. A little loud, but she does work. We don't want to break an axle coming out of the field. About, 
I think this is weighted up at about 30,000, 30,000 pounds. in here this year we got a grain bed on the other side we're still working on building as soon as we get it up we're gonna run it out the back we got to be careful we don't collapse any walls because I think this is gonna be close to 300,000 pounds of force the black that's in the corn there on the end is an embryo and it actually shows that it's uh, mature fully mature it's nice when you're harvesting uh, dry corn and it's not too wet you can see this flows really really well we're running an 8 inch wall auger um, on a 540 PTO so we can we can usually load this is like a third of a semi but we can load or unload about a semi every 25 minutes of grain. Here this one's about 360 bushel. A semi holds between 900 and 1,000 bushel. Really when you get much over 900 it's overweight but a lot of guys run them overweight. So, so and this one's about 350 so it's a little bit more than a third of a semi.